Uh, we just tasted some 2021s, both red and white. And, you know, I'm a, a big fan of your um, Chardonnays. So it was really fun to, to taste them. And, and as usual, really great depth and structure to them. So talk a little, about, little bit about 2021 in general and what your thoughts are about the quality and the Sure, season. sure. I mean, 2021 was an absolute winemaker's dream. We had the ultimate luxur- luxurious harvest. Uh, we were able to pick things at their optimum. We didn't have the influence of heat waves to force a pick. Uh, for Chardonnay, we had good long hang time, um, but still beautiful natural acidity. It really was one of those harvests that don't come around every single year, that is for sure. Uh, but when they do, we're, we're really thrilled and, and happy about that. And but how did you get that polish to the tannins? Because I've already written, I was impressed with the, the tannins and 21 with maybe the, like, let's say 50 wines or barrel samples I've tasted, but there really is a polish to the tannins and more so than in years like 13 or 16. I don't know if it's viticulture or Mm -hmm. it's winemaking or a bit of both. Yeah, I think absolutely both. You know, early on when we saw the reds come into the winery, it was very apparent that we had a massive amount of tannin potential that we were dealing with. And, you know, being really thoughtful about our extraction, I think was the key to getting those really fine tannins. And there's something interesting in 21 that I think is different than what we saw in 16. And really that has to do with the acid tannin interaction. So in 16, I think things were riper. So you had more of that juicy, ripe, plush fruit, and then the tannins kind of supported it, and that created the balance. In 21, we have tannins plus natural acidity. So there's a different sensation that's happening uh, in terms of texture and mouthfeel. And I really think is, is what is going to you know, define this vintage and what is going to you know, cement the fact that these wines are going to be uh, long-term, long-aging, and, and really going to go the distance. Great. That's perfect. I look forward to tasting the wines, the reds when they're bottled, but they're already uh, fantastic. Thank you.